Let's take a time out. A lot of you guys ask me a lot of questions, and most of them are in regards to body fat. Mm -hmm. So today, I'm here to answer those questions. A lot of times, you'll see a lot of fitness professionals on Instagram and YouTube, and you'll look at ways to burn body fat, but in reality, all they show you is different workouts, like different crunches, different ways to walk on the treadmill, different ways to run, and it's really misleading. I'm just gonna give you the blunt truth on how to burn body fat in one specific area. There are a lot of shortcuts to moving body fat. Most of them come along with people having surgery, like, you know, your Kardashians and whatnot. And that comes with moving body fat surgically, cutting it off from your stomach, moving it wherever you want to move it, to your butt, to your chest, seeing one dude, elbow. I don't know where he was going with that. It wasn't pretty. This simply comes from the fact that nobody's going to be happy with where our body decides to store fat. Truth is, in all honesty, you can't decide where your body's gonna store that body fat. Your body just chooses and you have no say so in the matter. It's the craziest thing. You have absolutely no say so. You can't eat broccoli and think it's all gonna go to my abs. You can't eat bread and think it's gonna go to my calves. It can go anywhere and usually it's where you don't want it to go. So you wanna spot reduce body fat, right? You wanna know the truth? You can't handle the Truth is, you can't spot reduce body fat. It's just not gonna happen. Truth is, you can't spot reduce body fat. It's just not gonna happen. In other words, you cannot target body fat in one specific area. You have no say so in where the body fat goes to start with. So in addition to that, you also have no say so of where you lose it. The only way you burn body fat is if you burn it as a whole. It's either all or nothing. So <laughs> you can't just keep working out this one arm and then lose it here. You might lose it in your calf. You might lose it in your knuckles, you never know. The only way to lose body fat is to consume less calories than you expend. That means for all the calories that you burn inside the gym, you have to be eating less calories than that. So you gotta do the math. So in actuality, cardio, some good cardio, along with weightlifting, is actually the most efficient way to lose body fat. So you gotta have a little bit of weights in there whenever you're working out. Which brings me to my next point, the sauna. Jesus Christ. So you know what, I'll break it down to you like this. A lot of people have a misconception, or a misunderstanding rather, of the sauna. It burns body fat, yes, and you do sweat, you lose water weight, not the way you think. You think about it like this, you put like a, a piece of food in the oven. If you don't want it to get too hot, what do you do? You put something over it, cloth, foil, something like that, so it's not getting too hot. Instead, if you want to heat it up all the way, what you would do is just leave it out. So instead of wearing a jacket like this, in actuality, like this. This is what will make you sweat. But let me say this, you will lose fat. Water weight. It does not burn fat the way you think it does. It will, but at a very slow rate. The only way to truly do that is cardio and diet. So if you have any questions or comments that you want to make, make them down below. Do me a favor, please hit that like button because it'll, it'll help me out a lot, you know. Hope I answered your question. If not, yeah, please drop a comment and ask your question. Until next time, I'll come back. Uh, I'm sweating a lot. I'm starting to smell like moose kiss. Uh, don't worry about that. Until next time, I'll see you guys then.